everything is by chance. Even in a desolate Colorado prairie, where there should just be an open field, there's a pole that marks a spot. If not for an accident one decade ago, 10 lives wouldn't have ended right here. And if not for a tap on the shoulder, the youngest of them all would now be 30 years old. That was the plan nine days later after the team lost a January 27th game at Colorado. They were set to fly home out of Jefferson County Airport on three aircraft provided by Oklahoma State donors. Kyle Keller had a seat on the slowest plane, a 25-year-old Super King Air turboprop similar to this one that the team had been using for years. Nate was set to leave on another plane, but at the last minute, there was a change of plans. King Air traffic is now at your three o'clock two miles. Ten people boarded the King Air. Nate was joined by his teammate Daniel Lawson, four members of the basketball staff, two members of the broadcast crew, and two pilots. I saw every one of them looking at me through the window. That is not a great feeling. 